Hey guys, this is Dano, and uh, I'm in need of a tripod for my camera. And I got all this bamboo laying around, and I got a few pieces that I heat treated. And uh, so I'm gonna make a real simple tripod to put this camera on out of this bamboo. And uh, I got this bolt here that screws into the bottom of this camera and uh, I put it through this cap I may use a piece of styrofoam as filler I got a hacksaw some gl some hot glue uh, some string some duct tape if I need it. I'm gonna try not to use it though because it leaves a sticky residue. We'll just we'll just see about that. And uh, I want my tripod or my camera to be able to bend without my tripod falling down, just in case I need to you know aim up, aim down, etc. So uh, what I did was I had some copper wire and I cut a bunch of little pieces of it and stuffed as many of it as I could into this rubber coating I'm gonna cut it off smooth and uh, nice and then I'm gonna probably glue it into the into here where it's all nice and secure and then fix it to a piece of this bamboo let me show you what it's gonna kinda look like it's gonna be somewhat like this like I said if I need to to bend it for some reason I won't have any problem with that but alright guys I can't really record anything and, and build until I get this tripod built so I'm gonna pause this and uh, put some of this together show you some of it and then I put a little bit more together and uh, once I get it built I'll show you some other projects but alright y'all but all right, hold on a little bit and I'll, I'll get this assembled alright guys I decided to use these biggers or this bigger cap instead of this little Mountain Dew cap but I got my styrofoam here I've pressed with the cap and I'm gonna cut it out with just a regular hacksaw blade and then uh, after I get these two caps put together with styrofoam in it I'm gonna cram this wire in there and glue it and, and I got my drill so that I can put this bolt through it and uh, once I get it all assembled I'll, I'll show you what it looks like and over here I got the legs of my tripod cut gonna look a little something like that but uh all right let me get this assembled and I'll show you all some more this is Dano I wanted to show you that I'm just gonna use some washers as as fillers so there's not a big chunk sticking out below the camera I cut a hole in both these caps and then I bent all these wires that I crammed in and then I twisted them around so that I'll have a real good snug fit and then I'm about to hot glue them in so that they won't go nowhere and then I'm gonna have styrofoam stuff between them and then I'll tape it up to make sure it holds and then that should be a good uh, nice secure fit
I got lots of hot glue on those bent wires that'll keep it from going anywhere and now I'm gonna cram these two together and then tape it up give me just a second all right guys and she is pretty much complete now this is just a temporary tripod so that uh, I can have something to hold my camera while I build a better one but this will work until then and uh, I drilled a hole and I put just a bolt in to hold the bamboo and I did the same thing up here if I ever wanted to pull this cap off and swap it out this is just a little bit of duct tape, a little bit of, oh, oh, and uh, if for any reason I needed to bend that, like if I'm working underneath a car on a lift, I can bend my, my tripod back. It'll swivel just about any direction I want it to go. And when I build my better one, I may keep this part. But uh, I built this with within an hour, and I was really taking my time. I wasn't in any rush, and you know, I, I didn't really care how it came, turned out since it's just a temporary tripod. But all right, guys, that's it.